Hi guys, it's Gloria from Crafted with the Heart. How is everybody doing today? I am back to share with you uh, a little bit of uh, things that I picked up from Hobby Lobby today. I hope everybody's having a great weekend. And um, I went out again. I'm addicted to Hobby Lobby now. No, I forgot about our Tuesday morning and now I'm Hobby Lobby. They're having such a great sales that I have to go back. So I, you know, haven't spent so much like yesterday when I did the video and today, but I wanted to go back and pick up some stuff that I left behind and I was hoping to find them there and I did. So um, I'm here to share with you. Thank you for all those nice comments. Thank you for all the ladies that uh, commented and gave me feedback about um, different uh, ideas or different places to look or people who might be able to help me um, with the computer situation I managed to do the video now I'm trying to figure out how to do the editing and add the music so I'm determined to conquer this this brain thing is not gonna stop me so you know sometimes forgive me because sometimes my words get kind of um, tangled or I forget in the middle of the conversation but it's part of it I hope you guys understand but I'm here to share with you with all my love. So anyway, I went back to Hobby Lobby and I picked up a couple of things for the clearing section. I actually went there, spent, my husband dropped me off and he went with my grandson to across the street from the uh, other strip mall to the GameStop to pick up a game. I said, leave me in Hobby Lobby, you guys go and do your things. So they went there and they left me. I think I spent like, I, we got there around six o'clock and I think I spent like two hours into closing. <laughs> I love that place. I went into the flower section, guys, and I lost myself into all those beautiful flowers that they had. And of course, I was looking for the best prices, the colors I wanted. I did find the, the two lanterns that, um, that I had ordered, that, that I had seen uh, Arlene. Arlene uh, got hers from an antique place in Virginia, I think, on Williamsburg or something like that. But I fell in love with that lantern. But guess what? I went to Amazon, I found them, but I found two, the big one and the little one. And I didn't have no other choice but to buy both of them. I fell in love with them. And Amazon was the only place that has them the cheapest. And the only reason why I picked it up is because Arlene does such a great job in that lantern that I fell in love with it. It's one of my favorite colors, the red. And uh, the way she decorates them with, uh, with the, the the design that she does with the, uh, what they call those bows? Jeez, uh, funky bows. That's what it is, the funky bows that she learned from another lady. I, can't for, I I watch her channel too, guys, but I'm so bad with names. Anyway, I that's what happened, and um, I fell in love with it, and um, I hope she doesn't, she, she doesn't get upset or anything that I bought them, but um, she does such a beautiful job. I just have to. I love her decorating. I love the way she does her swags for the lanterns i love the way she does the funky balls she's such a sweetheart the way she she portrays herself the way she decorates her home you can see how homey and how welcoming it is so guys check her channel out um i told the name is like the crafty what the heck is it oh jeez something i know i mentioned it yesterday guys but i forgot like already anyway let me show you this yesterday on the video i forgot i showed you guys the box uh, when I went to Walmart, I showed you the box of the machine. This is the machine. I still have, I forgot the batteries, guys. I was supposed to go to Home Depot also to get some stuff, but I got stuck in Hobby Lobby, guys. So anyway, this is the machine. It's not that big, but it's big enough. Um, the numbers are pretty, pretty nice. And it comes with two, two battery, two, two tapes. And it uses three, uh, three AAA batteries. So I haven't used it yet. I have to get batteries. But anyway, let me sh start showing you guys what I picked up from the 80% clearance. That's how I shop. Sometimes I purchase stuff, you know, but not often. I picked up with the 80%. Look at this, guys. It says yum. Isn't this beautiful, this plate? And this was uh, $15.99. I pay $1.59 for it. $1.59? No, was it $1.59? Let me see. 80% of, of, let's see. Uh, how much was it? $15.99. Let's see. I'm sorry, no, I paid $3.20 for this. Boy, my math is bad. It is bad. Woo! $3.20 for this. So 
So it's so cute. I'm gonna put it on a display like this. The way to show you, I had, <laughs> This magnolia leaves have made me change everything in my house, in my home decor. Well, not everything. I incorporated it. I already had some type of um, giraffes and stuff like that. I like it like, I like to bring the outside in. I told you this before. So this is what I'm doing. I have, I made the two magnolia leaves. I'm going to show you. I'm almost done. I got the mirror today, guys. Finally, I got the mirror. I always wanted a mirror for that wall that I have a big zebra. I don't like that zebra, but somebody gave it to me. Anyway, I got this basket i can use it for valentine's i can use it in my everyday decor it's pretty big this was 24.99 and i paid five bucks five bucks for this it's all white chicken wire and red i can use it in my kitchen i can use it in my dining room i can use it anywhere because i have a lot of the, the from the kitchen up to the lanai the red is incorporated there the living room and the antique tables area, since they, they're kind of an L shape, I try to keep them almost the same color. Those colors, I basically, right now they have teals and golds and browns. That's what I have there. For them, I'm getting ready to change that teal curtains because the curtains is what accentuates what I, or decide, I decide what to do with the rest of the room. But I like the browns because browns are colors that you can incorporate any color with it. Anyway, going back. Talking too much, guys, today. Blah, 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 blah. I'm still stuck in the 4th of July. I'm reaching over here, guys. I picked up two of these. These were $7.99. And I paid for these ones. Where are they? Let's see. Huh. $7.99. So it will be... It was 80%. So I figured, like, say, 90% will be... 79 cents, like a dollar something for them. A dollar 49. Yep, dollar 49 I paid for them. I got two of them, and these are pretty big. I'm gonna, I have two, the lights in by the garage. I am gonna try to get a wreath and put this in there, and I'm gonna incorporate them into the light for the 4th of July, Memorial Day, and Labor Day. So this will be nice. It says it calls it a bow. Patriotic bow, that's what it says. So I got two of these. Along with the 4th of July, I'm sorry I'm reaching this way, but I have to know that that's there. I picked up another one of these. Uh, very pretty. It's supposed to be for outside, so but I, I'm not going to use it outside because I don't want the growing. I put stuff outside. That the sun here is terrible, guys. What happens? America? Oh, no. America is supposed to be like that. Isn't this nice? It's pretty big. And I don't know how much this was. This was 80%. I only spent 31 no, let's see how much I spent. Thirty-one at twenty-six. That's all I spent today. And this was. Let me see what it says. Probably doesn't say the name, so I don't know. Oh, maybe two forty, maybe. Maybe two, like two forty. But it's so pretty. I got two of those. I the one that I showed before, and this one. And then I was looking when I picked that one off of where they had it hanging. I found this one. Oops. Was two ninety nine. This you could be use it in, in accents and accent pieces on your wreath or any decor you have. And this one was a uh, dollar forty nine. Yeah, dollar forty nine for this one. So yeah, it was two ninety nine dollar forty nine. That doesn't make no sense because if it's two ninety nine, eighty percent can be a dollar forty nine or oh, sixty cents. I'm sorry, sixty cents. 60 cents. Now it makes sense. So I got that. Then I was looking around the spring section that I don't know who I saw. There was um, somebody did a haul also from Hobby Lobby and they were showing. But I found this stack. It's like to plant tomatoes. 100% natural. And this is a picture that they show you what to do with it. But I'm not going to use this. This is going to be part of my decor. I have a palm tree, a artificial palm tree that has the base in the bottom. And sometimes you want to decorate that. I'm going to put that inside this. And this was $17.99. And I pay for this one. Let's see. $3.60 for this one. So that wasn't bad. They said, okay, that wasn't bad. And the size on this is... 
20 by diameter by 14.5 high. So it's pretty big. <laughs> pretty big. Let me see. Let me open it. Let me see if I can open it because I'm going to put it there. It's like a, it has that burlap uh, type of a material. Let me see. Look how wide it is. Put a plant in here. That's what it's made for. Actually, you can use this. Wow, I didn't think it was going to be this big. Woof. Oh my God, this is huge, guys. Look at this. I was thinking it's a little thing. I'm going to have to shrink it. Look how big. Oh, wow. And it has a hole in the bottom. It's actually to plant stuff. Maybe I'll plant some tomatoes. What do you think? I have already peppers. I have four peppers already ready to pick, be picked. And I have sweet peppers as a hole for the water to come out. So that's nice. Then, uh, out of the spring, I picked up this, guys. It was originally $49.99. I paid 10 bucks. That's the price. And they had the smaller ones. They were $6, guys. But I said, I only need one, guys. So I picked up only one. So that was 10 bucks. Then, I am going to make another magnolia wreath for the mirror that I got. This was $3.99 and I used the 40% off on this. So, that's what I paid for that. I don't know. What, what did I pay? 40%? Let's see if they have the 40% here. Yeah, it was... But it's a uh, $2.49. $1.49. That's what I paid for that wreath. Then I got... I used all of the other leaves that I have. So I picked up one, two, three, more, four more of these to make the magnolia wreath. When do you see, guys, how pretty they came out? They came out really nice. I'm going to show you guys. Be patient. But they, this is this world sale. They were $4.99. All this stuff into two more is going to be 50% off. All the flowers. Um, a lot of 80% stuff, a lot of 90%, the 90% they didn't have much, but the 80% they still had a lot of stuff there. They already finished putting all the Christmas stuff already, and I was going to go into the fall decor, I said, you know what, I still have time to pick up stuff. I, I'll pick up the sales stuff, and then I'll do this. And then this one were $4.99 each. Uh, let's see. So it's 4 Four ninety nine. So they were two fifty each. No, let's see. Yeah, five dollars, two fifty. Two fifty each bush. And I can make two wreaths with two of them. And I'm talking about sixteen uh, uh inch wreath. So I can make two wreaths or three wreaths out of this. Last time I picked up seven and I did something for the bottom of the my um, china closet. I'm gonna be showing you guys. So I got that. And then, last but not least, I'm gonna. Then I have to get up because I have to show you guys this big the mirror. Sorry for the reflection, guys. But they were on sale. Can you see it? It has these little things here. I fell in love with one that cost three hundred dollars, but I don't want to. <laughs> This was $99 originally, so I pay $50 for this one. It's very heavy. It's made out of wood. It has the sockets here. Not the sockets. The thing where you hang it. I don't know if you can see. Over here, let me see. It's so big. There you go. So this part here is incrustated in there to, for support because it's heavy. So my husband's gonna have to put support inside the wall for this. Um, it was a hundred dollars originally, and it has. Let me see if I can. Ooh. It has this thing here to hang coats and whatever, but I'm not gonna use it. I'm just gonna use it. May, I might put a like, garlic or something, but I want to make a wreath to hang it here. That's what I want. So you see what I, I'm gonna do. Anyway, guys, I wanted to come. And bring you this. I'm still working with the computer stuff. Sorry about that. Ugh. Boy, when you get old, everything is heavy on you. So anyway, thank you so much, guys, for being for 
being here with me for the nice comments for trying to help me I really appreciate that and I don't give up easy on the things I do I'm determined to do what I have to do to overcome this I know it's not gonna be a hundred percent but I'm still here and I hope I've been an encouragement to anyone out there that's what I'm hoping for I love people I love to be around them but I'm down here in Florida so this is the only way I can communicate with you guys blessings to all of you from Florida have a nice rest of the weekend and I'll be talking to you guys soon I have a trendy tree share to do what I might do it tomorrow to show you the nice scarecrow display that I'm planning to do for the fall take care and God bless